Heavenly Father, I come before your holy throne now and ask that you open my heart and my eyes to hear and apply Psalm 10 in my life. Guide me in wisdom and truth through the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Why, O Lord, do you stand far away? Why do you hide yourself in times of trouble? In arrogance the wicked hotly pursue the poor. Let them be caught in the schemes that they have devised. For the wicked boasts of the desires of his soul, and the one greedy for gain curses and renounces the Lord. In the pride of his face, the wicked does not seek him. All his thoughts are there is no God. His ways prosper at all times. Your judgments are on high out of his sight. As for all his foes, he puffs at them. He says in his heart, I shall not be moved. Throughout all generations, I shall not meet adversity. His mouth is filled with cursing and deceit and oppression. Under his tongue are mischief and iniquity. He sits in ambush in the villages. In hiding place, he murders the innocent. His eyes stealthily watch for the helpless. He lurks in ambush like a lion in his thicket. He lurks that he may seize the poor. He sees the poor when he draws him into his net. The helpless are crushed, sink down, and fall by his might. He says in his heart, God has forsaken, he has hidden his face, he will never see it. O oh, rise, O oh Lord, O oh God, lift up your hand, forget not the afflicted. Why does the wicked renounce God and say in his heart, you will not call to account? But you do see, for you know mischief and vexation that you may take it into your hands. To you, the helpless commits himself. You have been the helper of the fatherless. Break the arm of the wicked and evildoer. Call his wickedness to account till you find none. The Lord is king forever and ever, and nations perish from his land. O Lord, you hear the desire of the afflicted. You will strengthen their heart. You will incline your ear to do justice to the fatherless and the oppressed, so that man who is of the earth may strike terror no more. O oh, Heavenly Father, the words that were penned here in this psalm just causes my heart to grieve. For I see even in this year of 2020, I see wickedness abounds. I see the people still attacking the vulnerable, taking advantage of the vulnerable. There are con artists galore. Everyone is for themselves. They have no accountability. There is no judge. They think they can get away and they do get away. But Lord, you remind me through this word that you are the omniscient Lord God Almighty and you know everything and you do see it is in your timing lord that you shall judge and there'll be none of us who can complain none of us will say that what you do and your justice and your judgment is wrong for lord you are holy and you are just and you know the afflicted you know those who cry out to you and you do answer oh lord i take comfort that you are a God that hears, you are a God that answers. Oh, Father God, I pray for all of those who need the prayers, including myself. Oh, Lord, come. Come and fill us with your peace and remind us you are the Father, our Heavenly Father to us all. How much more will you not know to give us the best? As we wait upon you, we choose to trust in you, and I trust you, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. <laughs>